Hey, listen, how are we all doing, man? Today, I want to talk on something very simple. Very simple. And I'm going to address this to women. You all know now, I speak about everything on my platform. Men, women, drama, issues, but no bashing. We don't bash people on, on this platform. Check this out, right? Just because a man changes his mind about being with you, just because a man dates you and say, I don't want to be with you for real. Because dating is supposed to be the testing period. Do I want to be with you? Can I see my the, my life with you? If I can't, I don't want to date you anymore. Just because a man goes out with you and changes his mind. Just because a man rejects you. Just because a man doesn't want you. Does not mean that men don't know what they want. Let me let me, let, let me let you know something. You are not the pinnacle of women. You are not the pinnacle of our women. You are not the highest level of women. If a man says that he's not interested. If a man changes his mind. If a man says, I don't want to be with you anymore, that's just what it means. It doesn't mean that you have to make yourself feel better or bring forth your ego to say, men just don't know what they want. No, it's not that. We know exactly what we want. And if we don't choose you, it doesn't mean, listen, if you don't choose a man, is it because women don't know what they want? You know exactly what you want and you don't want him. So why can't we have the same choices? Why can't we exercise the same damn choices we don't want you we don't want you why are you also mad listen just because a man doesn't sleep with you or want you doesn't mean that he's gay it doesn't mean that he's confused it doesn't mean that he's stupid you all gotta stop doing this thing man it's like reject it's like when somebody rejects you especially as a woman you think that your rejection is the worst thing ever it's not we all get rejected men and women alike get rejected see when a man approach you and you reject him do you if he says anything or disrespects you, isn't, isn't, that just, isn't that just rude? So why do you feel like you have the right to think that men don't know what they want? There's a lot of men out there who have women and who sticks with their woman and who takes care of their woman and who loves their woman and who is all in for their woman and who provides for them. A lot of men do that. So when you say men don't know what they want just because they don't want you, it's very selfish, it's childish. Everybody who gets to know you don't want you. Everybody who gets to know me don't want me. Everybody who gets to know me just because they hang out with me and they slept with me and but doesn't mean that they want me. They was, maybe maybe they hang out with me for a while and realize hey, they ain't the one that I want to settle down with. So why can't that be just like they see you? Maybe sometimes they get to know you and realize, you know, you're in it. I don't like your attitude. I don't like how complaining you are. I don't like that you're always feeling insecure. I don't like that you're always this or always that. It is what it is. But stop saying that men, men just don't know what they want. They just, if they don't want you, let it be. Listen, cross them off, right? It makes your selection or your choices easier. See, when a man shows you that he doesn't want you, it makes your life easier. At least you ain't got to put effort or energy into that man anymore because you know they don't want you. Put effort in someone who wants you. Put effort in yourself. Put energy into your own self. Stop complaining about who doesn't want you. You all don't want every man. Every man don't want you. It is okay. You all be doing too much, saying too much just because somebody rejects you. It is okay. Let it be. Like, like you know, men ain't stupid, right? We're not stupid. I know you all think that we stupid. We're not stupid. We are not stupid. We know exactly what we're doing. We know exactly what we don't want, just like how you do. But just that men, you know, we don't really deal with our feelings. I don't care how fine you look. I don't care how sexy you are. I don't care how big your booty is. I'm not deciding me being with you based on a feeling. I'm deciding being with you based on can I walk with you and ain't nobody talking trash. Can I be with you? And I'm talking about at different levels. It's not necessarily me I'm talking about. You know, can I be with you and be compatible? Can you be that all around woman that I need? Not just the finest looking one, the one with the big old booty, the one with the big old chest, the one who looks the sexiest, because that's not what men look for. Yes, to play with. See, because a lot of times men look for two different women. One to play with and one to be at home with. And a lot of times, a lot of you all who look that certain way end up being a game, end up being played with. A man does not play with everybody. He doesn't play with every woman because every woman don't tolerate that nonsense. Listen, just because he played with you doesn't mean that he played with the next. 
Because the next woman probably ain't putting up with a mess. See, some women gonna put up with certain things because they just feel that way. They don't really have standards. Not standards, but boundaries. If you have your boundaries, I don't care how much you want a man or a woman. If you have your boundaries, people ain't playing with you. You don't mind losing people. Because when you have boundaries, you can't be afraid to lose people. Because when you set your boundaries, people are going to walk away. Period. But if you have boundaries, you said, listen, I'm telling you, I mean, you all be playing, you all be thinking that men are just silly, men are playing games, men are stupid, men know who to play games with and who not to play games with. Every, just because a man treats you bad doesn't mean that he treats the other woman bad. I promise you, he doesn't. And I'm not saying it's wrong. I mean, I'm sorry, I'm not saying it's right because it's not. Because I think we should treat everybody equally. But if we don't want to be with somebody, just don't, don't, you know, don't play games. However, everybody is not the same. Everybody don't see it that way. Some people think some women deserve more than the other. I don't know. Just like how you think some men deserve more than the other. Like, for instance, if a man pay all your bills and do this and do that, you probably will give him more than you give to the other. That's nature. I'm telling you guys, man. Just because a man play games with one doesn't mean that he play with, 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 with the other. You are. I'm just saying. You are. I hope you understand what I'm saying. There's no disrespect. There's no bashing. But just because a man doesn't want you... It doesn't mean that he doesn't know what he wants. He knows exactly what he wants and it's not you. Just because you don't want him, it doesn't mean that you're confused and you don't know what you want. It just means that you don't want him. That's it. Peace.